there everyone welcome back to my channel I've had requests from you guys to see sort of my makeup room my makeup collection etc so I thought I would go ahead and show you the makeup room and I'm gonna show you today my palettes I'm gonna show you my palettes for eyes and my palettes for cheeks I've actually filmed this video like four times and at first I was showing you guys everything I had as far as the collection goes and it was just too, too much. It was too long, too much, too involved. So now we're just gonna focus on the palettes for today. I'll do another video down the road of more of my stuff, maybe my lips, the lip section. But here are my palettes and my makeup room. I don't have the hugest collection in the world. You're gonna be probably surprised because I run a really tight ship here. If I get something and I don't like it, I will take it back and I periodically go through my drawers, empty out, sell stuff on Poshmark, throw stuff away, give stuff away, etc. So I don't have a huge collection. You're going to be probably be surprised. There are certainly there are certainly people out there that have much more stuff than I do. So here are my palettes and my makeup room. Okay, here is my beauty room. There's my vanity, my vanity girl. Hollywood mirror. My Those lights on the walls are from Glamcore. Over here you can see the edge of my desk with my trash can looking Mac. That's a, that's a computer, that black trash can. Can you believe that? And that's my editing desk. And then over here we have a little sitting area. That light up there. I used to have two of those lights. I still do, but I mean I don't use them to film anymore because I've cut back on my lighting and I like it a lot better. Here's my little sitting area. Sometimes I'll do videos over here. This um, little armoire there, that little piece there is where I keep all of my nail stuff. Okay, my palette drawer. These are my most used and loved palettes. And then in the drawer above them is face palettes. We'll go over those as well. So starting with the eye palettes, let's start with back here, these big ones that kind of don't fit. I've got the BH Cosmetics Carly Bible. I have the Desert Oasis from BH Cosmetics, which is beautiful metallics and good highlighters in that one. The Natasha Denona Star palette. Don't use that one enough. Beauty Daydreamer from Too Faced. I keep forgetting about these cheap products. These are really pretty over here. I have to remember that one. And the Marc Jacobs. This one was called the Wild One. It's an older one. And some small palettes out of the back. These are the Too, Too Faced Tutti Fruity palettes. This one is the Berry one. Let's see. That one's called Razzle Dazzle Berry. This next one is the pineapple scented one. That's so beautiful. That green and that gold. That one's Sparkling Pineapple. Milani Most Loved Mattes. Milani Pure Passion. Milani Bold Obsessions. Too Faced White Peach Palette. I have these beautiful Wet n Wild palettes, these new ones that I did a video recently on. They're Natasha Denona Mini Palettes. This is the Mini Lila and the Mini Nude. Pat McGrath Labs Mothership Sublime Bronze Temptation. Don't use that one often enough. Ciate Glitter Storm. Love those glitters. NARS Assist. This is Melt Cosmetics 27 palette. And I love those colors. A couple of Rimmel palettes. The Crimson Eyes Edition. Or the Crimson Edition. This is the Electric Violet Edition. And the Urban Decay Naked Heat. It's beautiful. Pat McGrath Labs, I can't remember the name of this one. Bronze Seduction. Bronze Seduction, that's it. The new Marc Jacobs Stiletto Palette. Gingerbread Palette from Too Faced. Gingerbread Spice. 
Huda Beauty Rose Gold Remastered and Huda Beauty Desert Dusk. This is Dose of Colors. Uh, Friend Cation. Charlotte Tilbury Stars in Your Eyes palette. And Anastasia Beverly Hills Soft Glam. Anastasia Norvina. And Anastasia Sultry. Some of your stuff toward the back here. This is the Urban Decay Beached My Shadow Palette. The Alimar Cosmetics Palette that I got in my Boxy Charm a while back. This one's Reina del Caribe. And the Lolita from Kat Von D. I have this very large palette that will not fit in that drawer, and that's the Fetish from Kat Von D. I have never used this one. Okay, cheek palette's a drawer, and then the drawer above that is highlighters and cheek products, highlighters and blushes, and bronzers, and sculpting powders. <laughs> so what I did was I took, I had some, I had some cheek palettes up here with my highlighters and stuff, and I took them out so I can show you all of them along with all of these that are in here. These are just kind of bigger ones that will not fit in this highlighter drawer. As you know, I love highlighters, and I have an extreme highlighter collection. There. So in the cheek products. I have the Pure Sculptor. This one is so heavily used. I love it so much. It smells like chocolate. That's why it looks terrible. Uh, the It It Girl Beauty Book. This is like an all sorts of things palette. It's not just cheeks, but I use it for cheek stuff. I like to use that blush. I like to use that highlighter. And I really like this brow powder down here. This Tarte Clay Play Volume 1 palette. I only use these colors at the bottom here on it. I don't really use the eyeshadows because I don't like an all matte eye. So, but I really like these two shades here and I use those a lot. That is my favorite contour colors right there. Uh, the Benefit Pretty in the USA palette. That one smell, that one smells so nice. I just had to smell it. <laughs> Smashbox. This is their contour palette. This one is called the Cali Contour. I forgot the name of that one. Too Faced Coco Contour. I don't really use this one anymore. I may uh, be selling that one on Poshmark soon. More palettes. The wonderful Hourglass Ambient Light palette. I mainly use this color in the middle as sort of a all over face finishing powder after I finished my makeup. The NYX Born to Glow highlighter palette. This has some amazingly metallic and brilliant highlighters in it. Laura Geller Life Glows On. Smashbox Ablaze face palette. I think I have too much stuff. I forget about this stuff in here. This is um, Pirates of the Caribbean. This palette here is so old and I just keep it for nostalgic reasons. It's really old. It's called the Danny Marr palette from years ago. I just keep it because it's just an old favorite from thousands of years ago. Too Faced Natural Face Collection. It smells wonderful. Becca Jaclyn Hill. Mine has a broken hinge, but the powders are still good. Anastasia Dream Glow Kit. Radiant. And both of the Natasha Denona Diamond and Blush. This one is the um, Citrus. And this one is the Daria. NARS Hot Tryst. Gorgeous. NARS Assist Wanted One. These are all really light. I don't know. I don't know if I want to keep that one. I'll have to think about that. Narcissist Unfiltered 2, the Cools. Narcissist Unfiltered 1, the Warms. Those are my palettes. Looks like I chipped the paint on there. 